We've had a particularly bad hurricane season this year. To be fair, it only takes one severe hurricane in order for it to be remembered as a particularly bad one. But this year, we've already had two Category 5s and the season doesn't finish until the end of November. Now, part of the reason why we've had such destructive storms has to be man. There's not really any way around it at this point. Because the world is warming, it means the seas are warming. This means two things really. Firstly, the seas are expanding, and that means if you get a storm surge, the base level for the sea is already higher than it should be, so that storm surge will be that little bit higher. And also, the seas are warmer, which means there's more energy for these storms. These hurricanes feed off the very warm waters of the sea, so the warmer that the ocean is, the more energy these storms have. So we're not expecting there to be more storms necessarily, but the storms we see are becoming increasingly powerful. The other thing, that, of course, that has to be addressed is what we're doing to the Earth. Not just making it warmer, but really changing the landscape. Before, perhaps, when there was soil and mud, it would have been easier for water to be absorbed. But if you tarmac a large area, there's nowhere for that water to go. Houston is one of the fastest growing cities in the US. Now, they had a phenomenal amount of rain from our storm Harvey, and it would have flooded no matter what. But we have tarmac large areas, and if you change a region that much, that has to have made matters worse. Also, we're building in more precarious areas as well. When we had flooding in the UK there, we were building on floodplains. In Houston, people were said to be building inside the dam regions. We've also got to look at deforestation because the trees are really there to protect us in a way. If you take away all the trees, then you're suddenly more vulnerable to flash flooding and to landslides as well. Obviously, it's the poorer countries where we're seeing the deforestation at its worst extent, and that's where there's the greatest problem because you've also got very vulnerable houses. At the moment then, there's nothing really changing. We're building like we've never built before and the world is still warming at a very fast rate. The earth is still heating, there's more energy for these storms, we're also changing the landscape, things will continue to get worse.